Okay, so a frequently asked question uh, from a perspective fun to Linux user is about time of install. So, uh, vote if it's in Russian, I think that's how you say it, uh, asked this question. How often do I have to compile CLang slash LLVM on Gen2 Fun2? I feel bad for my laptop, and that's the only thing that's stopping me from using a source-based distro. So this is something we actually really try to address. We have GNOME stages. So um, you can just download a stage three that has all of GNOME, all of LLVM, even Firefox compiled from sources, has a kernel compiled from sources already. You just extract that and install it, and you're ready to go. Another thing that helps sort of on an ongoing basis, which is different from Gen 2, Gen 2 is a true rolling release distribution, which has its benefits um, and negatives. The, the negative is that you tend to get updates to packages whenever Gen 2 decides to roll out a new update, and it can be kind of arbitrary. With Fun 2, we take a snapshot of Gen 2, and we use that to build out a release, and we tend not to bump critical packages. Some packages still get updates, but we tend not to bump the big packages like GCC or LLVM within a release. What we do is we wait for a new release to bump those. So if you install a GNOME Stage 3 tarball, generally you'll be set. Um, you, can, you can have a fully functional system and not have to build any huge packages. And let's say that laptop doesn't have a lot of power then what you do is when a new release comes out, you just install the new tarball. So I think we have you covered there. I hope that answers your question, and I hope you find this useful. Thanks. Bye.